the ridge cap or whatever you call it is being put on. Here Jose is spray painting the pole that holds the power line. He's done that to all the different uh, vent pipes and uh, connections. How are you, Hannah? Are you scared? Hmm? Are you scared of the noise of the roofers? Hannah, come here. Good girl. It's around, I don't know, one o'clock or something on Friday. And Jose has just left. Everything's done except for one little thing that I'll talk about a bit later. But here's the back part of the main house. Beautiful. They put a, that thing in the middle is called an eyebrow, but it's ventilation. A uh, little, little slit for ventilation that goes under the shingles and into the roof. And that thing on the right is for the wall heater. I believe the vent and this thing on the front sticking out is the vent for the kitchen plumbing and unfortunately I cannot see what the roof looks like on the top of the second story but judging from all the rest I'm sure it's beautiful and you can see today they were working on putting the ridge caps and doing all the flashing and everything so this is the back as you can see also they always leave the place spotless after they're done cleaning everything up and blowing it with the blower here's the side of the house that they cleaned up after all the work but here's, I wish I could see that, but up there, that is the tiny little roof. This bump out, I believe, used to be for a fireplace long, long ago. And while I'm on this side of the house, I might as well tell you about the little, little, minor problem this pipe that goes up along and up through that little tiny roof used to be also extending at an angle and up along I think attached to the outside of the roof eave and up above the roof maybe about a couple of feet and it was the actually which we didn't realize uh, is the vent for the water heater that I have in my basement. And we didn't realize that uh, until later. And previously, Jose had removed the top part of the vent. And in the process, it was 
slightly damaged, kind of bent out of shape. But then we went into my basement to double check. Originally we thought it was just an unused, that maybe they had a stove here or something. But it didn't even occur to me that it was the venting for the gas water heater that I have. And so we still need it. And so within the week, Jose is going to purchase new vent pipe and a cap or whatever to fix this. In the meantime, it's okay because it still vents out of that top of the pipe. But I don't know why I didn't, we didn't even think of that earlier before he removed it. But it's a small problem. So this is from across the street. There's my house and new roof now. He even painted all the little vent pipes. And uh, that's the power line pipe. I wish I could see the top of that second story, but I'm sure it's just as nicely done as this. So there it is. Four days of Good work. Now the next thing I need to do in the next weeks or months is decide on paint colors. I'll probably keep it pretty much the same, just new paint. But if you're ever interested in hardworking, good roofing company, Google Ideal Roofing Company, Jose Guerrero Zaldivar in, uh, I think he's based in Santa Clara. Good workers, good prices.